welcome to my channel. So I'm going to do a quick flip through of my September and what it looked like because some I think I did a plan with me, some I didn't. You can see some of my planner clips peeking out for fall. I'm going to do a surprise reveal of one of my winter paper clip releases and we're also going to plan with uh, the October month at a glance. That'll be my first time doing that with you guys. Usually I do that alone. Um, it's not something I do like super well, so maybe I'll be able to add and decorate a little bit more because Halloween is my favorite. I have some stuff. I picked these up at Walgreens today. They were two for a dollar. So you can see those. But I thought these would be cute little, I can use them as checklists or just cute little decorations. But they're all just kind of little dots. I think they're the same shape in that one. And then I got this one because it was different by a little bit, I think. Maybe it's not. I don't know. I thought it was different. Are those the same? Yeah, I think I got two of the same. They just have different covers. That's cheating. Anyway, so I got those. Apparently I have two of them. I have to send that to a planner friend. Oh, she doesn't celebrate Halloween. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Um, then I've got some Halloween washi tape, a couple of different brands of that and then I've got um, the fall golden leaves that was from the Target dollar spot I have this sticker set which I want to use it's by a sassy sassy sticker store and it has those October is my favorite color I'm so glad I live in a world where there are Octobers I've seen this before in other planner videos um, so I think I'm going to use this to decorate more of my monthly. Um, the to-dos though and the todays I'll probably use in the other one. And then I went ahead and took these samplers back out. It's the, it's just Paper Co. sampler because there's some pumpkins and some fall on there. And then I also took back out the Keaton Town sampler because it's very fall colors and there's even like a fall page flag. So I may use these now. I may save them for November, I'm not really sure yet, but I want to take them out so I have them ready. Um, and then my planner pal will send me some die cuts and things that I may want to use. And some stickers, like there's gold pumpkins in here. So I thought I might use those. And then she has some other die cuts here. And then she also did some, um, she put in some Halloween scrapbook paper. But she also embossed. Ooh. She also embossed some all looking okay. papers, so I might use those. I don't know. I kind of take everything out that has to do with the theme, and then I go from there on what I want to actually make it look like. So let's go ahead and start on the September flip through. So I actually finished all of the pictures this time. Um, so you can see the Heidi Swap is supposed to be a memory planner. It has more photos in it. I don't put photos really in my weekly layouts, and then usually these I just fill with cute little cards, kind of to decorate for me. This I use for her birthdays this time. This I just kind of decorate because fall is my favorite, so I put that on there. And there's my September at a glance. It's kind of a hodgepodge, like I said, I'm not like super good at decorating the at a glance yet. Um, I like putting quotes in there. I changed this one to remember. And then September Happenings, all that really happened I thought was going to be Saturdays, but it turned out we did a lot more than that. This is September 1st through the 6th. So I did kind of a red and green theme. I feel like I incorporate a lot of green because of the green that's already in the planner. So I get kind of frustrated with myself when I do that. It was also back to school a little bit for a few people so I put that on there I did this sticker for the open house that I had going on threw a little bit of fall in there that's some scrapbook paper okay we did not like Jed's pizza sorry if you do but ours was not good um here's September 7th through the 12th so some scrapbook stickers some new stickers I use my Unity stamp still. 
really fall with the leaves and I like this mini cloud washi. Not sure how well you can see the clouds, but they're on there. And then this one is September 13th through the 18th, and this one was the Elegant and Organized. I think I did a plan with me on this one. I can't remember. And then those owls I picked up at um, Walgreens. It was like with the card section. This one is the Jolly Fat Elf stickers. I think I did a play with me on this one this last week. Um, so that turned out really cute. I really like the pink and black. And then we'll put two. Yeah, this week. So it's actually on there. It's kind of part of my layout. I like to have my paper clips match my layout. So this one is a fall theme with the well, there's animals I made sure I incorporated my fox back in. These are little cards that I make. I laminated this one. I like to whole punch lists. This is a fall bucket list I'm going to keep in here to check off as we go. This is a pumpkin paper clip. He's really cute and happy. Those are also available in my shop. Um, and then I think that is the end of September. I wasn't sure what to use this last page for. I may do like a month reflection. It does have lines on it, and then I can cover up some of this with washi, so I may do that later. So let's look at October. It says dreams come true. I'll probably decorate this at some point. And then this is what the photo page looks like empty. These are empty. I don't think I'm going to have time for a photo challenge this month, so I'll probably just use that for birthday. Sometimes I put the photo challenge in there. There's also a thankful for stuff on the back here, which I don't think I did on September. I don't know, I did. I used it. Okay. And then you get to this, like, kind of blank. It's it's not cardstock, so I wouldn't call it, like, a blank dashboard, but it's, like, the page that's the back of your monthly. Okay. So that's what October at a glance looks like. And it has October happening, so there's no typo on this one. I had a typo on one of my pages. I think it said July happenings, and it wasn't for July. It was like August or September or something. And then I think um, this week, this next week, is going to be my dad's birthday. It's on the 2nd. So I'm trying to decide if I should decorate just his birthday for his birthday, or should I decorate the whole week in a theme kind of around him, which is why I bought these Keaton, Keaton Town Star Wars sticker sheets. Because um, I'm thinking about using that for this week. I probably won't use all of them. I don't know. I don't know. Because I think I might want to save some for when the movie actually comes out in December. But I might decorate this first week of October in a Star Wars theme for my dad's birthday because he likes Star Wars. I also picked up some Star Wars stickers that were in the dollar spot. Right there. So I might take those out. These aren't like cartoony and cutesy though, like humans. These are like real pictures from the movie, I guess. And they're not all the same. I think there's two of these, you know? They're different. I think it's two or three of the same one. And they've got some on here that I don't even, I don't even know. So I'm guessing there's gonna be new stuff in the movie that I have never seen before. But I grew up with Star Wars, so it's been fun. Rule of the Galaxy. That's cool. Hmm. Loyal Chewbacca Loyalty. That's cute. So, they're not super cutesy, which is why I like to keep them better. But I grabbed it because it was Star Wars and it was only a dollar. Alright. So this will probably be my next Plan With Me video, which I'm not ready to do yet. So let's go ahead and take out the October at a glance. my planner to the side. Okay. So I wanted to do kind of a fall mix of Halloween. Halloween is my favorite holiday, but it was funny. I was watching TT Plans is what her YouTube is. I was watching her and she was talking about how she has kind of gone away from decorating because she realized it's kind of like almost like it's just for her or the kids really aren't that into it. Because her kids are like teenagers. I mean, I'm like, 
Mike is not a teenager, but I think, not that I'm getting tired of Halloween decorations, but I think I'm going to go more fall, so that I don't have to, like, redecorate it all the time. Okay, I think I'm going to do... Mmm, this is hard. I know I want to use the wider washi up here. I think I'm going to use the words so you can see more of them. And then the October happenings. That might be that one. I don't know. I think these are the perfect width for, width for this one. No, it looks like it's a little short. Okay, then I think I will just go ahead and use the wider washi for that. So I don't have to cut it. Or use the stripey. No, because you need to go see the green. We need to use a black. Let's use this weird one. It's got purple in it, too. So that might be good. This is Walmart one. This, this, and this are all Walmart. These are Hobby Lobby. But they were already on sale. Like they're already discounting it. Oh, runaway washi. They're already discounting their Halloween stuff. So their washi was discounted, which I got there. It's not Chevron like that. It's Chevron in a different direction. I got that one on clearance, and I bought two rolls. And you can see I definitely use this one a lot. Um, it was from their clearance from their St. Patrick's Day, so they have. I might check back when they clearance out the Halloween the washi to get more, because Chevron orange and Chevron black together, um, but separate, not necessarily. So you go like that. That's kind of already sticky. I stuck something down there, and then I decided I didn't want to keep it there. So that's what happened. I changed my mind. So today was a pretty good day at work. I think I have double conference, which means I don't have kids for like three hours. Which, to be honest, like I like it, but then I don't like it because it makes my day feel longer. Like the kids talking to the kids and stuff makes my day go by faster. So I don't really know how I feel about it. I do feel like I'm more productive in my conference periods because I have like a longer time to get things done. I'm just trimming this off. Um, it was funny. My we had um a community cares day where we don't actually go to school. We send the kids around the community on kind of a field trip to do things around the community. Like at elementary school, you're just cleaning up stuff. So they were doing that. So I didn't get to see my sociology class since phew, last Tuesday. So it was funny. They were all like, we missed having this class. Because <laughs> I didn't see them for so long. We finished watching the movie Nell. Ooh, I like that. Um, I think they really liked it. I did have one student that was like, Spider, this movie's gonna make me cry. She's probably gonna watch this too. That's what she does. Some of these kids you have to understand. I used to teach freshmen for a little bit. And then I taught, I teach right now sophomores and juniors. And I taught sophomores and juniors last year. So some of these kids have had me. I'm their only social studies teacher. So we're really bonded <laughs> at that point. Like they know my personality pretty well. They know my expectations. But she's one of those. I had her as a sophomore. Now I have her as a junior. She's had other social studies teachers, but. Pretty sure I'm her favorite. <laughs> anyway, I also looked at my October. I'm looking pretty busy at school. Because I'm taking tomorrow off to go get the shots in my knee for my osteoarthritis. 
which I'm really glad I'm doing because today I hurt really bad. It was not a good day for my arthritis. I don't know why. The weather was nice. It's not like I'm... Most people are like, oh, it's raining. My knees hurt. It's not really like that. Let me go ahead and punch these. So you can see what it looks like. Um, sociology was good at mine in my world history class. And I currently have a practical student. Which, I don't know if you know what that is, so don't be like, what is she talking about? And I'll explain. So she, he, actually, comes from a college, and I don't get paid any extra or anything for doing this, but he comes in and he watches me teach, and he, apparently he's supposed to learn that way. I swear most days he's learning what not to do, <laughs> but I think he's having a good time, and he said that he's kind of learning a lot too. Like he's learning that he should have made, paid more attention in high school. What his teachers were doing. I think a lot of people feel that way. My mother in law always says that she wished she would have taken, she wished she could redo high school now that she, like, would pay attention. Sorry, there's stuff stuck on my punch. Okay. Oh, and then like five minutes before school was out, they did a, I don't know if it was a schedule drill or one of those, there it goes, one of those like surprise drills. Some kid just pulled the fire alarm. Seriously, like five minutes before we got out of school, they did a fire drill. <sighs> I was lucky my kids were already packed up, so we just went outside and I told them to take their stuff and then just go home because I was like, I don't need to drag you back up there just to say goodbye. I kind of messed up. Whatever. Anyway, so that was kind of a weird end to the day, slash, so give me a headache. And then they went off one more time after, like, school was already out. I was like, seriously, get it together, guys. Okay, so I think that's the only place I'm going to put that washi in this video. It is kind of dramatic, but I like the purple that it's going to incorporate. Okay, and then I said I wanted to go wide at the top with the words. I have another one of these that I've been using to package up whenever people order something from my shop that's kind of like Halloween thing like the pumpkins or like I have the teddy bear dressed like a pumpkin if you order that I decorate your package in Halloween washi usually and I also include some Halloween ribbon paper clips I, I don't really do like decorative sticker sheets I usually like to buy those because I feel like the silhouette does a better job on those and I don't have a silhouette. But I wouldn't give up my career for anything. I love it. Okay. So I'm going to put this over the top here. That looks good. Oh, I'll just tape two pages together. I like the Walmart washi tape. It's not plasticky like the Dollar Tree. I mean, I use that too, but. And these are only 97 cents. They don't come with a ton on there, though. But it's enough to like, decorate with, I think. I want to probably either put black or orange shit on. Oh, I don't know. I think so. I'll do that at the top there. Yeah. Okay, that's wrinkled. <laughs> okay, now I don't want to cover up my October at the glance. There's good. Yeah. I like the words, they're cute. It says like spooky chills. Schools, rest in peace. My little poison bottles. I think it's cute. And then I said I was going to do my orange washi. I'm trying to figure out where it starts. Bear with me. 
There it is. So I also decorate my lesson planner, which doesn't have a monthly view. But I decorate that at school and the kids are some of them started to notice <laughs> and they want to like look at it. So that's been kind of fun. So now I'm not doing it just for me. Kids want to see it too. Okay, that's gonna be a little bit of a gap at the top, but that's okay. I've been working. I made two Halloween cards. One for my pocket letter pal. Should I have to turn that off? Yeah, I'm going to. Because it's not going to cut off the October. It's too skinny. We're going to cut it off. Anyway, back to me not being at work. So I was looking at the dates for the field trips. And then I'm part of this, it used to be called Literacy Leaders, but they changed the name to, I want to say Master Learners, something like that. Anyway, they changed the name, because it's going to be more like PBL training, which is project-based learning. And my mother-in-law asked me today if that was common core, and I'm like, I don't know, it's just something I get paid to do. So will pay me a little action, I get a little stipend at the end of this year, like in the summer, for doing this little thing with them. And since I don't have any masters, I don't make a lot as a teacher. There are some teachers that, like, they've gone back to school so much that they actually make a really decent amount. I am not one of those. Okay, what do you guys think so far? I think we'll zoom in. I'll zoom in a little. Maybe that's what it is. Okay. Uh, so I use that. I use that. And I think I'm gonna use this down here because I have that gunk down there. Comes with five yards. The Walmart washi tape. It's also wider than most washi tapes that I've ever bought. I've seen some now that are coming out. They're like, I say like two inches wide. I saw some in the Sydney Faith's video. She did like a, she wanted to show her washi stash, which was great. Made me buy the washi organizer. Actually, I my mom do it. <laughs> I didn't make it anything, so she decided to buy me something. Again, which is cool. Plus, it was on sale. It's that, like, Recollections washi holder. I think you guys can see it right now. It's that one. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put this in the October Happy News box. We have a lot of birthdays in October. I think TT plans the same thing. She's got a lot of birthdays in October. My dad's birthday is the second. My mom's birthday is the eleventh. My brother-in-law's birthday is also the eleventh. Oh, that looks cute. And what else? <sighs> Maybe that is all birthdays in October. So there's one that. Okay, so I'm not going to be at work tomorrow, and then I'm not going to be at work on the 6th, it's the 6th, the 9th, the 13th, and there's a teacher work day on the 12th, so I'm not having a full week of school until like the third week of October. It's kind of crazy. I'm going to be gone that often, and it kind of sucks, because... I have to make a lot of sub plans, which is almost more work than actually being gone. Okay, so I'm 
October 1st is a Thursday, second so Friday. I have to write those in. I'm going to use my orange. Let's look and find purple. No. No, the paper may flare pen that's purple is like a pastel purple and I don't want to do that. Okay, so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Thursday is the first. So I'm going to go ahead and write my numbers in. I keep saying that I'm going to create stickers for this. I never do. So the sixth is for the sociology field trip. We go to a local college and they put on kind of a presentation for sociology, psychology, and criminology. We don't have criminology at my school, but they do at the college. So we bring the forensics kids too. And then the ninth is that training I was talking about. And the 13th is a Magna Carta field trip. We take a couple of living law kids that want to know more about the Magna Carta. It's like an anniversary tour thing that they do here. It's at the library. Is that the library? No, it's at Missouri State. But the kids are kind of hesitant to go because they don't get out for the whole day, they just get out for an hour. But I have to have a full day sub. You heard that that was my shoulder. I pop a lot. <laughs> 24, 25. Yeah. Six and seven, thirty, thirty-nine, thirty, thirty-one. Okay, so I end up with one extra box. So we already know what we're gonna have for Sunday for Halloween because Target last year was doing that. Buy one get one. Free Halloween costumes. So I definitely jumped on that. I need to put some washi up here, which one I haven't I used yet. A black chevron? Ugh. We'll do this stripey one. I mean, ugh, on the black chevron, it's just kind of boring. Maybe I'll put it down here. I like to block out the day's washi that I don't use. This is more fun. This thick washi is like almost perfect for half washi. Okay, I'm gonna tear it and then cut it so it looks better. Because this washi is too wide for my exacto knife. It's much better if I cut it. And it cuts really easy. And then I'm gonna go ahead and do this right here. And it matches the top. No sound of button. Keep cutting off the paper. Mm, see, that's what I don't like about this washing. I didn't have the paper, I just kind of like hold funny. I'm going to use all my washing except for that black chevron, which I don't think I'm going to use anyway. I'm going to come up with a Halloween quote. Okay, let's check it with some stickers. Let's use these first. Says, lovely. Thanks so much for your order. I hope you love your new stickers. XO. Let's 
cute. I got rid of it. I was using the calendar in my writing. Oh, you guys can see this. I can't tell my SMB. But she put in a little cute little note. I put in note cards too. Okay, so this is Q. It says today and to do. I think I'm going to take one of those to do's and cover up the notes section over there. That's right. There's the to do. There it is. Maybe it's too long. I want it to be centered. So cut it off a little bit. Okay, that's cute. And then I want to do the weekend. Friday, Sunday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. I'm gonna do brown. I think I'm gonna stick with the orange because everything's black and orange. I'll save the brown for the November layout. Hmm. Okay. Use the weekend sticker. It's kind of covering it up. Hmm. I have to trim this. It's too wide. I'm a planner. But I still really like it. Sometimes I feel like I just complain too much. And my husband would agree. I just complain too much too. This off. So there's a lot of extra poop there. Okay, so I made this a little bit smaller. These pieces are sticking. Let's see if that fits better. I think it does. So I don't mind covering up the days. Like I get that I know it's Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Most people consider it a Saturday Sunday. I consider it Friday part of my weekend. Okay. So that was better. I didn't want to come up with numbers. So my thing was. Okay, and then I want to put probably a Star Wars sticker on my dad's birthday. That would be cute. Okay. I can a little to go with my colors and use Yoda. Put a little Yoda on my dad's birthday. Mm. Oh, that's a very good trick to put on So that's the second, right? Yeah. Which is also this cool dance. And I have to go work it. This is when they want to dress gross. If you've never been to a high school dance, you have no idea what I'm talking about. But parents do not always check what their students are wearing, or they don't care what they're wearing. I've got a checklist there. So that's kind of annoying. October is my favorite color. I'm so glad I live in the world where there's October. I'm going to put this on here. See the brown one long enough to save. It's not going to go with this layout. Didn't use this. Ooh, I need coming up with users. Do I need to cover up a lot of my number? Yes. Err. Okay, so that's what's in the open. You're going to put it in the cool box. Yep, that's where it's going. Just cover up the cool box. I think I'm going to put 
since I know there's no special things to add in. And the sixth is a project. And the ninth is training day. Ooh, that's super crooked. Oh, good. There we go, just So looks good. Yeah. I need to have my school nurses. I feel like it does this to me. Okay, that's as straight as it's gonna get. And then I set the fit. Using a ball orange and leaving all the brown. <laughs> it's funny. Okay. I think that's all I'm gonna use right now. Cause the orange half box thing. I'm not sure where to put that. More than today. So, then using those. Let's see what I'm using. Let's put a little acorn on my stickers. Okay, and then I like all of these. We'll put that on my mom's birthday because she likes. All the leaves. Well, I'm going to get a little white. I'm going to cut it off. That's perfect size for that box. Keep me free to go. You got this. Mail. I don't know what to put down on there. No. Some pine cones, really cute. Like that. I'll do the leaves for this one. Mix it up. That's cute. Pumpkin spice latte. This is from It's Just Paper. Cause I have the minerals on Halloween. Fitting, I think. Okay, now let's see how they're bumping. We'll put those on this side. The gold leaves, but I don't think they really match. They'll go with the brown, I think. Okay, let's see. I'm going to put one orange. An orange sparkling embossed pumpkin. I should have this on her xylon. She die cut it and then put the image in for xylon to get that cute little highlighting in the image. And the color of the reserve box in. It's all weird with the line in the middle. I'm going to put it right here. That's cute. Okay, I'm going to decorate some Halloween sticker book. This one called, it's called Witch's Way, and I already cut out the repeat half when I took it to school. Put it back a little bit there. Alright, so I know I want the kitty cats because I have a black cat. And they're adorable. I don't care what people say about black cats. So, there's a large one. No. Okay, there's a kitty. And there's pumpkins and corn. Okay, I'm gonna start putting random stuff in there. 
there's spiders. Candy. There's a spider with a top hat. It's annoying. I like the candy corn that's like Marcus Poison. That's what I use. Let me just decorate it up. Okay, I think there's a cute little witch in here. Yeah, she's like a witch that's also many out apples apparently. I think she's super cute and I want to put her on here. And I forgot that I wanted to. Uh, I'll put her down there. Mm. See, she would have been perfect, I think. I'm throw this cat off. <sighs> Amazing. These are like repositionable stickers. I don't know if they mean to. But it worked for me. She's cute. I'll put this little cute over here. Mmm. She's a purple one. She's in the green stuff. It's like squash and candy corn. I love candy corn. There's frogs. And lizards. I don't really understand that one. All these cute pumpkins. I'm gonna take trips to pumpkin patch, I think. It's gonna come down. I don't want to see It's cute. I don't care for the squash. I have a black kitty on there. Let's do another black kitty. Just cut off the nails. Okay. Yeah, there's another leaf on here. I can use it to cut off that quote mark. Because it's going to be bothering me. These are, really, these are glossy. They're squeaky. I think that bothers some people. I don't particularly have a problem with it, but some people it does. What do we think? Am I done? Am I not done? I feel like there's like. Blankness there. Hmm. This is so weird. Little piece kind of weird. So is the frog. There's another little girl, but she won't put there. Well, I didn't even come up with a number. She's a little orange witch. She didn't even come up with babies. Yeah, she's got my nose. So I kind of don't care right now. So not, like I said, I don't use the lot of this calendar. That's cute. I got this stuff to make apple pie. I'm excited about that. And I think I'm going to be done. Should we put some candy on Halloween? Yes, we should. Screw Okay, we'll put the weird little frog. I think he's weird. Okay, we need to drag him in. I'm gonna go stick to the field trip.
remote is Master Planner Institute. And this is another field trip. That's weird. And mom's here. And then to the pumpkin patch. And chicken treat. Let him hide. Let's Kind of like the way it turned out. It looks cute. How is that? I like it. Show you one picture of this closer look. That's what I did at the top. Acorn. That sparkly pumpkin just gives a little bit of shimmer to my beach. So I'm loving that. Okay, what else did I say I was gonna do? Oh yeah, the paper clip reveal. Let me get drink. Oh, I didn't use any of the little one. Uh, I meant to use this. I'm even happy how long this took. You're adorable. Sorry, guys. You're like, wait, you're gonna tell us. What you don't know. I'm using my stickers. I like the moon. Thank you, it's fine. I like the eyeball. It's funny. I'll do this because it's at a glance. That's funny. Gross, right? Okay. Trying to do a little owl. There's no follow. I'll do this to the spider. I do the same. Do I do this way or do we end up this way? I'm gonna put two of the stickers on here. Probably. I don't want to kick. It's a ghost. It's a little ghost. Okay. I think it's got enough stickers on it now. Okay. So I've only gotten a bunch of one kind of paper clip made for Christmas time slash winter really. And it is this one. Is it dry yet? Yeah. It's dry. So here you go. 
it. That's a big reveal. He's a cute little penguin, and you can see there are glitter on his hat to give it that fluffy, shimmery, icy glow. Okay, so this is my paper clip. That's the back. So you still see the back of the little hat, but I just did a black back on him so you don't see the ugly thing. So he's going to be going up in my shop very soon, so you want to keep an eye out for that. And I made lots of him. I made three gold ones so far, and then I have five other ones that I don't put paper clips on, because sometimes people are like, I want red, I want silver. I don't care. So you just tell me, and I make it. Okay, so we will do a play with me on the first. Yeah, we'll do a plan with me on probably, probably on the 30th, because I'll want it ready by the first. Oh. So I'll definitely do that. I think it turned out really cute, and I'm really happy. This is probably my best ever month at a glance, I think, that I've done, because <laughs> I don't usually do them this much. But it's also a holiday month, so and birthdays. Alright, so thanks for watching. Give it a like and please subscribe. If you have any suggestions on Christmas or winter or holiday theme paper clips you'd like to see in my shop, just let me know in the comments below. That'd be great. Um, I think I'm going to make one kind of like this, but in, um, it'll be a mouse, a Christmas mouse. And then I'm also thinking I'm going to do the bear dress like Santa. And then I have like a pine tree with a smiley face that I might do. I don't know. He doesn't look very Christmassy. I guess I could put some stickle glitter on him, but I don't know. Let me know what you think that you might like to see in my shop. Alright, give it a like and please subscribe. Thanks for watching.